first flight as commander, we were coming back into land. It was a night landing. And being a Navy carrier pilot, uh, landing on a carrier at night is always terrifying. In, in the space shuttle, it's, it's very different. So landing at night, in my perspective, wasn't a whole lot different from landing during the day. And we're coming in, it's a nice evening, coming back into Florida, and we, we enter the hack for a left turn to spiral down around to runway 15. Uh, Rick Husband was my pilot in the right seat. And so as we're right abeam the runway, uh, I look out the window and I can see the runway lights. And, and I told Rick, I said, hey, I've got the field in sight, beautiful night. And we're flying on around and we come through the 90, so the nose has only got 90 degrees, turn more to go before we line up on the runway. And I'm flying the, the instruments inside the cockpit and as we roll out on final, Rick says, I don't think the pappies are on. And the pappies are the approach lights that tell you if your glide path is right and they really back up the instruments that are on board the system. And I look out and, and he's right, I can't see the pappies. And by the way, now I can't see the first third of the runway lights. And I said, I don't think the first third of the runway lights are on. And uh, about that time, Rick says, hey, it looks like they're all going out. And uh, at this time, I was, I was kind of getting concerned. And, and by the way, the mission, the mission specialists on the mid-deck that can't see out, I'm sure at this point, are kind of terrified. And then it dawned on me, there was a cloud. There was this big cumulus cloud right on center line lined up. So as we're coming down, the cloud continues to block uh, all of the lights on the runway. And uh, fortunately, we went into that cloud and I figured it out and I thought about the mission specialist and said, hey, it's okay, it's just a cloud. Don't worry about it. And uh, we, we popped out of the cloud around 5,000 feet and voila, in fact, all the lights were on and uh, everything worked out well. But there for a minute, it was pretty tense when we really thought, hey, we don't have the runway lights on, right? And there are no landing lights on the space shuttle. So that would have been a problem. But unfortunately, it was just a little bit of weather that we couldn't see. <laughs>